Hello everyone, it's Jin Teacher again from Reading Town. Uh, let's take a look at today's article. Today's article is entitled Cyber Monday is Back. So first we need to understand what Cyber Monday is. Cyber Monday is a day that comes after a big holiday called Thanksgiving in America. So cyber has something to do with the internet. So something that we don't have to do in person, so we can do it electronically. So Cyber Monday is back and as you can guess, it takes place on a Monday. So let's find out more, let's read together. It says, after Thanksgiving comes Black Friday, one of the biggest days to go shopping in the United States. So Thanksgiving is one of the biggest holidays in America. Thanksgiving is always celebrated on the fourth Thursday of every November. So we just had it in America. And Black Friday is the day that comes right after it. Okay, so Black Friday is a huge shopping day. Uh, you can see lines of people standing outside of stores. Uh, it's a very good day to go shopping because there's a lot of sales. So that's Black Friday. Black Friday is the day after Thanksgiving and this is when shops and retailers mark the beginning of the Christmas shopping season and offer huge discounts on hundreds of products. So let's break that sentence down. So Thanksgiving uh, is that holiday where people come together, the families, uh, and this is Black Friday, the day where there's a huge discount. Discount means they cut the price, so there's a sale, and huge means very big. So there's a very big sale, and retailers, retailers are the stores. Uh, so for example, uh, in Korea, we have a lot of sh uh, stores that you can go in the shopping mall. Those will all be retailers. Uh, so those retailers, the stores, are starting their Christmas shopping time or this Christmas shopping season. And this is when there's a lot of sales on hundreds of products. Products are things that they sell. So for example, there's uh, computers, phones, and even clothes. Those are all the things that they would be having a huge sale on, a big sale on, on this Black Friday. Uh, for those who miss out on Black Friday, there's an online alternative called Cyber Monday, which was created in 2005. So it's been over 10 years that we've, have, uh, we've been having this sale. Uh, this day is Cyber Monday, so it's after Black Friday. So here's Thanksgiving on Thursday, then Black Friday when all the stores have their sales. And then in case you missed it, they created a new day in 2005 called Cyber Monday. So alternative, alternative means another choice. So you don't have to go and stand in lines outside on Friday. You can have another choice and do it online on Monday. Uh, this was created in 2005 and it says thanks to the rise of internet of the internet and the popularity of e-commerce it has become the world's biggest online sales day. So here uh, thanks to the rise of internet so that means the internet has become very popular. So as the rise of the internet and the popularity of e-commerce, e-commerce, E stands for electronic. So once again, it's not in person. I don't have to go to the store. So I can do it over the internet. And commerce means business, like selling and buying. So I can buy all things electronically on the internet. So that has become very, very popular and it's become the world's biggest online sales day. So out of all the days of the year, the day that they sell the most or make the most money is on Cyber Monday. Uh, a great number of people also purchase products online as they don't want to wait in a long and crowded line for hours in the cold. So like I said, on uh, Black Friday, people line up even the night of Thanksgiving on Thursday night. They camp out there with tents and they stay outside because they want to be the first ones in the store to get these great discounts. Okay, so instead of having to do that, you can stay home, stay comfortable, stay warm, and on Monday, go on your computer and get all the sales. Let's finish out the paragraph. It says, generally, that means mostly, for the most part, generally, Black Friday offers massive sales on technology such as electronics and computers, while Cyber Monday provides price cuts on fashion retail like clothing and shoes. So if you look at this article, it says Black Friday, that's when you want to buy all your electronics, technology like smartphones, computers, laptops, televisions, uh, radios. But on Cyber Monday, there's price cuts or sales. They cut the price meaning that they make it much cheaper, uh, you can find good deals on fashion retail, such as clothing and shoes, watch, right, a hat, jacket, things like that. Since both days only come once a year, let's keep an eye on the latest discounts and enjoy the best offers of the holiday season. So when it says, let's keep an eye, that means let's watch out, let's pay attention, 
and those days only come once a year, right? So I believe in Korea, they're starting something like Black Friday. Uh, I don't know if they have Cyber Monday here in Korea as well, but I know internet shopping is very popular. So if we don't already have it in Korea, I'm sure we will have it very soon. So these are two days that come right after a very important holiday called Thanksgiving, where people in America gather together as family and give thanks. Uh, it started with the pilgrims giving thanks for making it through the first uh, difficult winter season. So we have this kind of change in how business is done. Now we do a lot more shopping online. So if you see, this is from the internet. There's a lot of sales that you can see starting in the middle of November because the retailers, the stores, they want people to know these sales are coming. So Cyber Monday, I don't know if you guys enjoyed it, but this is the best time to shop in America. Let's go look at our questions for today. It says, Let's look at the first question. When was Cyber Monday created? So I said it was a little bit over 10 years ago. There is an online alternative, and we said alternative is another choice, right? Another way. There's an online alternative called Cyber Monday, which was created in 2000, that's right, 2005. So 11 years ago to be exact. Uh, let's look at the second question. Why has it become the world's biggest online sales day? So let's look at that. Thanks to the rise of the something and the popularity of e-commerce. So we said E is for electronic, commerce is the business. So rise means it's getting more and more. So rise of the what? What do we use? What am I using right now? That's right, the computer, the internet. So thanks to the rise or the popularity of the internet and e-commerce, that's why Cyber Monday is becoming one of the biggest sales day of the year. Let's look at the last question here. Why do many people purchase products online? Well, think about the weather outside, right? We talked about this. Because they don't want to wait in a something and something line for hours in the cold. So maybe you've seen it in Korea where people line up outside in the stores, but we see it a lot in America, especially on days like Black Friday. So it says wait in a long and crowded, long and crowded line. Crowded means there's so many people waiting in line to get in the stores. So I don't know if you've ever uh, been in a line like that before, but it's not something that would be very fun or very pleasant, right? It would be very uncomfortable because it's long and it's cold outside. Let's fill in the blanks as we finish out this article for today. So the first question, first sentence says, this is when shops and retailers mark the something of the Christmas shopping season. So we said retailers are the stores, the different stores, uh, and mark is when they think that this is the start, right? This is what they choose to be the start or believe to be the start. So mark the, it's another word for start, it's the beginning, right? So it's the start of the Christmas shopping season or the beginning. Let's look at sentence B. For those who miss out on Black Friday, there is an online something called Cyber Monday. And we've been talking about this word. It's another word for another choice. Uh, and we said that that is, that's right, alternative. So Black Friday, if you cannot get the sales then, then another choice, another alternative is called Cyber Monday. Lastly, it says generally or for the most part. It says Black Friday offers massive sales, huge sales, big sales on technology such as something and computers. So what other uh, category can go under technology such as computers? We have electronics like your phone, like your smartphones I mean, and your computer, your laptops, television. Those are the things that you can find on sale. So now that you learned about the huge sales that goes on in America, if you're ever in America, you can uh, get a little taste of American culture and go shopping the day after Thanksgiving, which is Black Friday. Or you can stay home and I'm pretty sure you can even shop here in Korea. They will probably ship it for an extra charge, but you can also enjoy the deals for Cyber Monday. Well, if you enjoy shopping, I hope this article is very happy or uh, very helpful for you. I uh, hope you enjoyed uh, this lesson and you learned a lot. I will see you again next time. Goodbye, everyone.